It may be less of a problem for Riles who plays behind a VPN in China with a ton of lag already. Uh, no, it's 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 not that. It even is worse for him because like those guns are server calculated. So like, I mean, I don't know if you were there when I described it, but here is a quick insight for this thing. Give me a second. Right, so... What the fuck? Why don't I have my, like, menus? Okay. So, here is the ship. Uh... What's going on? Here's the ship. He's strafing there. So... Can I remove this slide? So... You will see his lead peep here. Whatever. Let's do this. You will see his lead peep here. Right. From the center of mass. So in order to hit here, you have to... What's going on with this program? You have to aim your reticle here, right? And I'm talking right now about fixed, because... Because uh, Outer Gimbal complicates this even more, because you cannot control them. So... And this happens because the hit registration is on client you have the ship moving that direction your client knows what's going on with the ship he shows you the pip you fire the pip you hit on the client your client sends to the server i hit and server be like And server will be like, okay, right? And deals damage to the ship. That's why when you see two guys fighting between each other, um, you usually see them not hitting each other, but on their clock, because on the server, actually, they don't hit each other because of the delay, how they send projectiles, but then server receives okay this ship receives damage into the shield so probably i should deal damage to it and it doesn't matter that projectiles don't hit because that is just like vfx basically but then there are guns that deal you may say the deal I need a brush here to more, get more artistic. A O E damage, right? Like, don't stand in fire. World of Warcraft style damage. So this damage is server. Calculated. Okay. Because of the nature of the AOE, probably how they decided. Yeah, area of effect, exactly. Uh, how they decided to calculate it. So, probably they decided to not trust the client on the AOE damage. So, when a lot of things. Get in one bubble, server decides who has the damage. So that is why when we fly with a ship, trying to catch up another ship and pop an AMP on him, which has this radius, you think, oh, okay, I'm in radius. And then nothing happens. 
that's because you on your clients see the future because you are controlling the ship but you have to tell the server where you're going and then there's latency and then there is an artificial server delay for smoothening and then when all that happens actually you are here on the server and your bubble catches not nothing because you're not there right so that's about the aoe damage so distortion guns since whatever patch started dealing aoe damage so when the projectile hits from the distortion gun d it pops up and deals an aoe damage trying to touch the components with this bubble okay so we have three guns three type of weapons that are broken because all of them are dealing aoe damage it is 788 combine right it is distortion and it is jericho okay jericho which are rocket pods because the idea behind them are the same there is a projectile that flies it hits it creates splash damage and that is calculated server side um yeah and because that is calculated server side you see what's going on with the your target right here which is actually what's going on on the server after all the calculations it's just your latency that differs not really not really a big making not really a big difference but then when you fire at this spot with the server side guns which happens there is your latency plus server smoothing delay ssd funny eh? something that delays is called ssd uh and that is usually around one second around because you're late because this this was once half of a second 50 milliseconds now it is on servers 250 ms then your latency for example 100 i know it's lower or bigger whatever 100 that's like three and then all the other bullshit that is happening and it goes up to around one sec okay so that means that you should hear a second later even a half a second later but the ship after 500 milliseconds is already here and on your screen you get this beautiful thingy on your uh, client you have this and you're like oh i hit but it's only client telling you that on client you hit and that's about it the projectile is calculated server side and actually you shot here while the ship was here so guess what you have to do you have to draw in your fucking brain this line further know this number in your head approximately and fire here while your pip is here right so you have to add up this here which is close to im fucking possible i tend to hit bigger ships like this but and then we have a very slow projectile speed so if the ship i mean it if it was like you know this speed and you have to hit here it's okay 
but we have a super sluggish projectiles right now in game compared to like early things so when the ship does this or this or like let's draw this yeah yeah fucking calculate this okay calculate this no way you will do it right okay And then there is another problem. That's the first problem with the distortion guns, and then there is another. S sorry. Uh, so... Ships have modules. For example, for example, cats coolers are around here, two of them, and cats power plant is here on the top, right above the ceiling. So here's the center mass. You have the thingy. You calculate your thingy. But you're hitting here. So considering they did an AOE damage to uh, distortion guns that need to touch like the modules. So you're firing, you're hitting center of mass, you're creating a small bubble here. I don't know what's the, like no one knows the diameter of bubbles, but I, I think it's, they're small judging to my dozens of experiments. I don't think they're like this. There's something like this. You have to hit here. You have to know where the module is. Maybe, okay, maybe it's like this, okay. It's to penetrate deeper into the ship, but it's not like this. When you hit a distortion gun. So that's the other thing. You have to then interpolate this. That's another calculation, right? So... That's even more impossible. And... All of that would be okay, right? If, if it worked. Because when you do the tests on the static targets and you hit the right places, like here and here, nothing happens. Just like nothing happens. They Yeah, they drop down the shields, right? But you don't power them down. Because it's just something broken in mechanics that has been broken for a ages right now. So, I can confirm it properly works. If we exclude... Uh, if we exclude the... Um, problem with the dissing... Uh, and just make ships static... I know that you can power down the Gladius, the Saber... Prospector, uh, some other ships. I don't remember which ones. I don't remember about the penguin. But for example, like the smaller ships, and and it's like, okay, you can you cannot disable Buccaneer for whatever reason. It's just immune to this. And then if you go up in size, you cannot disable anything. Like you cannot disable cats. Um, you cannot disable characters, nothing. They just, like, they don't, they're not affected. If you shoot with the, not with scatter guns, but with the distortion cannons that have pro bigger alpha strike with one hit, so probably they generate a bigger bubble right here in the cockpit, around the cockpit. You will distort the MFDs because they probably have a properly working electronic module that pilots use but the ship won't stop because you're not like dealing with the engines you're not dealing with the power plant you're not dealing with the coolers and this doesn't work probably the reason for this because cat exactly is calculated stupidly so he has a small power plant for the common module that should fly away but it doesn't and probably all it tries to deal damage to those 
it has small coolers all here you can when you destroy the cat you can see those things there like a small power plant coolers all that for future use so only those modules are affected but no one cares on them because actually the ship uses this one and we try to dismantle and see all the big ships where the modules are. When you destroy them, you can see the modules. And yet we try to hit those spots and nothing happens. It's only the small ships and not all of them. So that's the second. And it's something broken in the pipeline of the ship creation. And that's why, like, you know, that's why I'm, I'm trying to make it beautiful. That's why um, you cannot disable it. E even if they're not desync, if they, if they, even if they're like standing, you know, at one place. Okay, and end of uh, lecture on distortion cannons. So no matter like what happens, like Riles, if he's effective or not, it's just nope. Th this is basically the science I've been doing for more than a year, and no one cares really. No one really cares.